Hello, this is Gaming Expert and today I'm giving you part two of my Sonic the Hedgehog 6 walkthrough. Um, now we're starting the, um, the first act, which is Square version. Um, so yeah, let's begin. Um, yeah, if you wonder why it slows down sometimes, it's because I've got it in HD. So yeah, kind of, that's kind of a good thing and a bad thing at the same time. But, uh, uh, yeah, so as I'm saying, this might take a long time to finish this walkthrough. Um, not just because it's long, but because I'm doing Super Mario Galaxy 2 as well. But I think that's just going to be a, a bonus one. This is my main one right now. Because um, it's kind of new and I wanted to try something out. Yeah. Um, I'll explain to you guys why I wanted to do this walkthrough and why you think I'm probably mental. Um, the reason I wanted to do this walkthrough is because I like I like the storyline to it and it's kind of like a childhood game. Well, if you call year six, year seven childhood, well, I call it that. Maybe. Um, yeah, that's the kind of idea what you get into. But um, it's just easy to complete. It. Well, occasionally, sometimes it can be a bit of a bitch, but anyway. Yeah, and. I just know it off by heart because I've completed it quite a lot of times. I thought I could have got that in, but no. mm. I just remember the level that I probably take quite a lot of time on, but I can always trim it out. It's like the Kingdom, Kingdom Valley. I'm not going to spoil anything for you guys because I don't really like spoiling things. The acts are pretty easy. Well, this one is anyway. It's like hated so much. I mean, it's not exactly that bad to be honest. There we go. Oh, Sonic stuck. I thought Tails could be a bit more fast. I mean, it's ridiculous, really. Um, he seems to be pretty fast on the cutscenes, but. Uh, We seem to do is like a little ring blast thing. Could have done better, but oh well, I mean, it's on the tails, isn't it? So. Yeah, they, I think the problem about this game is just that they fly out of control too much, but um, I actually don't mind it to be honest. I don't really like Silver's gameplay though. I like the car I like Silver himself, but I just don't like the character. I mean, um, the gameplay of him. It's not very fun, really. And he's even slower than Taylor's, not saying something. Um, I think we've got to do is like climb up into this rock now, so. And I'll just quickly go into this one. Get shut now. And hopefully get to the sonic now. There we go. I think this is a speed bit now. It's when you like speed up really fast um, I can't say if I enjoy it very much because it's kind of a bit out of control and he goes a bit too fast and that's a bit silly of me to say that because I know it's Sonic but he just absolutely goes really 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 fast and you got to basically, all you can do is jump and dodge Dark, yeah this is it. it I mean, it is pretty fast but we can get through it Involves a lot of these little wall jump things as well. I've just uploaded part one, so I might as well just get on this one. My camera, I just noticed, can only take like an actor to go apart at a time. Don't know why, but anyway. Make sure you've always got rings as well, because you, you'll survive the first time, but the second time you won't, unless you fall off the edge and you don't survive. But Graphics are quite good though. This was like the start of the 
the sonic era that we're in now, it's just the HD era. The covering Crisis City, I think, of this. So I'm kind of glad I was like hoping that it could be Crisis City because that's like the best act that they've got on this game. Well, that was a bit stupid there because I was actually on the track, but no, sorry, yeah, sorry about that. That's what I mean, you got to start over again and it's a bit piss annoying. I just got a one up now. Get some rings. I'm sorry for about that if I die. If I die. It's kind of hard there. I can't, oh. I'll see if I can trim it after the. We're not gonna make it. Uh, my um, PS3 button like clicked in, so. I just noticed I'm doing quite a lot of Sonic and Mario work because I haven't actually done any Call of Duty ones or anything like that. I've done like Halo and stuff but that's like just like a thing that I'll do occasionally. It's not actually uh, official yet and if I can't see him then I'll have to cancel it but it'll be things of when I see him so that like get all <laughs> hungry on me but um, no, I'll try, I'll try doing some Call of Duty when I get with the flow, but I need to like get better at I mean, my last one of clones went pretty good, I've got to admit. Uh, I think Colors is better than this game well, by far, because it's more enjoyable to do. This is alright though, except when it goes a bit too fast like this. Really get that. Right, I'm not gonna click anything now. I'm just gonna. At that part, I'm just gonna take my under controller because I don't think you meant to like control it. But anyway, I do. I'm losing to Sonic 06, guys. Same good as it. Right, I'm gonna have to trim this. But anyway. It's hard game to do an LP on because it's pretty solid. Try not to die this time. Though. It's pretty hard though. That's what I mean, I didn't even touch that. I mean, yes. See why people don't like this game. Then I can see why people liked it. So got to look at both point of views of this game. But yeah, the main thing is the story. Though I mean, that's kind of the best bit for me. I, I the, cut, the cutscenes are very good and stuff. And the music's quite good, like, I was up with this one, but right, I'm not even going to touch it now, I'm just going to let it go by itself. Oh, see? That's what I have to do, I and mean, that's it. And guys, it's finally over. And I don't care if it's going to be an E. Just made it. Oh, B. Well, tell you guys what I'm expecting that, but anyway, there we go. I guess I could do a bit of town stages for a bit, and that's one act complete. I saved the day, I don't want to do that again, do we? Loading screens take a bit too long, I think. Another cutscene. Looks like the princess was moved to another location. Let's head back to the city. Okay, the end of that cutscene now. We've got, I think we got to the desert next, but I think we've got to do a few town missions first. Yeah, I've got to collect a bit more information about Dr. Eggman. Don't see why, I mean, I think we both know about Dr. Eggman, don't we? Uh, okay. 
It's harder than so in Sonic Colors, really, because Sonic Colors, it's got like a direct path of where to go. This one, it's like, you could say it's like an RPG, really. Yeah, you can see you can't go that way. Yeah. So you just basically got to look around. I can't remember where to go on this, but um, I'll find out soon. I think you gotta help this girl and she'll help. Um, basically what you do on this game is basically just do missions and you'll basically like you know progress through it and then you'll get like an act and then you'll be able to go into the desert and stuff. Mm. It's what annoys me most though, is that you have that there's so many loading screens because there's no point of that middle loading screen, it should be just one loading screen and it shouldn't take as long as this now. And it takes about half my walkthrough just to do it but, oh let's go. Um, so, um, speaking of Sonic Generations, um, if you want, if you had to pick a stage to come to to come back in Sonic Generations, which stage would it be? Would it be um, maybe Casino Night Zone or something? Or what would you like? What do you guys like to see? And um, leave your comments below.